Don't let little stuff in this life bother you. Don't let little stuff in this life bother you. Every single day. You don't let little stuff bother you. Some things can be uh, avoided. Um, you don't want to take the time to uh, give too much heed to certain things. Certain things don't require your attentiveness. You can avoid it to protect your happiness. You understand? Some stuff you can magnify greater than it is and it could steal your joy unnecessarily. Satan is an instigator. And Satan trickily often takes little small things and makes them high and big and big. And it's really nothing. You can easily shut that thing down and not bother you. But he'll magnify it and trick you. Uh, learn to cut off the lifeline of parasite thoughts. Cut off the lifeline of parasite thoughts. Because some of the things that plague your mind, you don't even have to let it plague your mind. You can easily cut it off, but sometimes you're just lazy spiritually. And you don't know that you're lazy. Saints, doing nothing allows demons to do everything. Doing nothing allows demons to do everything. So you can say, well, I'm not doing nothing wrong. You're not doing nothing right either. <laughs> you ever thought about it like that? Sometimes you say, I'm not doing that wrong, but you're not doing that right either. So you're neutral. You can't be a free agent on the earth. A spirit going to occupy you. A spirit is going to dominate your mind some way, shape, or form. And oftentimes, uh, oftentimes, the spirit that occupies you is just occupying you because you haven't taken authority. So, um, learn the grace of not letting stuff magnify itself and rule you and control you because you don't want Satan to laugh at you and mock your life and trick you into thinking in a thought pattern that's destructive and you can stop that. You kill wrong thoughts and you don't let wrong thoughts kill you. And don't magnify stuff so that if it can steal your joy, it just show that you ain't all that powerful. And you don't want to be disrespected like that. Don't let the devil disrespect you. If 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 he can take away your joy, that means that you ain't powerful. It says uh, oftentimes we like to say, I'm powerful, I'm powerful, I'm powerful. But if the devil can take away your joy, you're not powerful. You weak and you gotta grow up. You gotta acknowledge sometimes that you're a weak person. Sometimes you don't want to admit it because you you're trying to boss in your own way. But if, if Satan can override you, you is weak. Huh? 
So keep that in mind. Don't let the devil take your mind places that you can't enjoy your day. You can't enjoy your life. You're not waiting for nothing to happen to have enjoyment. You have enjoyment right now. Stop waiting for conditions to decide your joy. That's not real joy. That's deception. And if you become a person like that, you're never going to be happy. Saints, I know this because I've been in a car for the Lord's sake. So I can sow my way out. And I was happy. I was joyful. I've walked miles just to get food for my mother or get food. And I didn't get bothered. I never complained. You got to know why somebody lives in luxury now. Are you willing to go through the stuff that they went through and have the right spirit and not be bothered? It's the same way in ministry. What if I would have got bitter and said, oh, F these niggas. I ain't preaching no more. Look how they do me. What's that got to do with nothing? You keep your excellence. You keep your purity of heart. You protect that with all diligence. For out of it flows the issues of life. Don't let stuff stop your focus, your happiness in Jesus. Some stuff can be avoided. <laughs> I guess in there with me briefly. Some stuff can be avoided. You need help, baby, with your milk? She's so smart. She, she hold her milk. And uh, she, uh, she feed herself. She be doing stuff. She, she like to do stuff by herself. <laughs> she like to walk now. She ain't trying to have you carry her. She trying to walk. Like, go on with your bad self, Zendaya. Go on with your good self, your wise self, Zendaya. <sighs> Zendaya. Glory homes. So discern the stuff that you can easily ignore. Don't let stuff kill your joy. Look at these Negroes. They got their they got their they got they so impatient. But I'm about to show you something. I don't care if they try to shoot me, I'll shoot them back. Look at that car. This the reason why they up there got a car like that. Look at this daggone car. Negro, that's why you was mad. Your car dog on the whole grill is messed up. It ain't got no teeth in the front. <laughs> His whole teeth in the front is gone. Let me tell you that right now. That was the price. So don't let our stuff bother you. Some stuff can easily, you just switch your focus. Oftentimes Satan, he, um, he'll magnify things in your mind so you can't have no happiness. Don't, do, don't let him win. Don't let him win. Learn the, the ministry of casting down stuff that's not supposed to be there. Huh? Don't, 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 don't let your whole life be based upon one little thought. One little thought. You, you imagine a thought. A thought most times is a little ant and you're an elephant. You the gorilla in the zoo. <laughs> Tell me what to do. Like devil, who the is you? Who the is you? 
you know, Periscope be auditing you now. They they cut out words. If you think that if they think that the words ain't supposed to be there, they'll audit you. Like you be like, man, did try to no, pass this. You don't know what you mess with. <laughs> Since you ever seen them people in it, all up in the screen. Them be the people with no oil. You see all up in their nostrils. You about to get this word today. You about, you about to get this word today. Ooh, ah, ah. Turn into a monkey on the line. Done shocked you. <laughs> Done shocked your whole life. You gonna get this word today. Huh, am I still alive? Huh? Who on this line? About to get it on. Saying Zendaya, she's so funny because she got she got my personality. Like she if she see me laughing, she'll just start laughing. She playing around. She don't even know what the joke is. She tells her, ah, ha, ha. Like Zendaya, you don't know what you laughing at. Tells her, ah, ha. When she get a little older, she gonna start doing like this. Ah, ha. But saints, don't let little stuff bother you. You can enjoy your life. You don't need stuff to be a certain way for you to have happiness. Praise God for everything. I praise God for socks. I praise God for shoes. I praise God that I got a nose. I can breathe correctly. I got a, all type of stuff you miss because you waited for things to be a certain way. Be happy the way that Jesus has allowed you to live today. And praise him and let him perfect that which concerns you. And don't be anxious. Saints, when I was broken, I didn't have nothing. I wasn't anxious to become rich. I wasn't anxious to have no money. I said, I'm going to sit my behind in these heavenly places and sow my way out. And I'm going to trust the process. And I'm going to let Jesus do it at his own time. I ain't going to manipulate you or put no money in my hands. I ain't going to pray and cry aloud for you or put no money in my hands. I'm going to sow and I'm going to do my duty. And I'm going to watch you overtake me while I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. I'm going to do my duty, and while I'm doing my duty, you're going to do yours because you've been doing it even when nobody was doing their duty. You, you was faithful when everybody was faithless, so I'm going to keep on doing my duty, and I'm good. See, get in your mind. I'm just going to do my duty. You don't wait for other people. You don't wait for this world. You don't wait for situations or conditions. Just do your duty, and you'll be good. If you in a line right, and you waiting for another person to let somebody skip them. You not going to let. <laughs> Are you trying to get it? Then they're trying to get her chips. These chips was closed on you. She got little baby chips. There you go. Where you at with yours? How you doing? Then they'll be trying to snack on her little baby chips. Now. Last but not least, don't wait for somebody in a line to let somebody skip them. If God telling you to let somebody skip you in the line, if you watch them, they ain't going to listen to God. But you, you listen to God. You know that God telling you to let the person skip you. So let the person skip you. You might look like a fool and other people might get angry, but that's what God told you to do. If you're looking at other people to do what God told you to do, you got to remember over 90% of this earth is not in the spirit. All right. So. You in the spirit, so you you make the difference. And be happy. Nobody want to be around nobody that, that got no sadness. And you you mess up the gospel. You mess up the, the testimony of Jesus on your life when you sad or you unhappy. Show forth the joy of the Lord. I remember I used to make people laugh when I was going through poverty and stuff like that. And God was shifting me and I, I was stripped of everything. I was still making people laugh. You would never know if you met me. I didn't start doing videos at that time, but you, you will never know because my spirit was right. If your spirit is right, it don't matter what condition you're in, you're going to have a right spirit. So have a right spirit despite what you think need to be changed. Sometimes things don't need to be changed. You just need to be changed. Sometimes it's you that need to be changed. Cause even if things get changed, you still the same you. Let the you be changed. So that you can be in a palace even if you're in a pit. Because you can get in a palace and still be in a pit. But if you change, you'll be in the palace no matter what. The pit, the fire, 
wherever you at. You is deciding your location on this earth. Not nobody. You deciding your location. You are deciding where you're at. So decide to be in the heavenly places all the time. All the time. Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to mess with. Live long and prosper. You ain't watch the Facebook Live. I hope your phone go dead. I hope your batteries don't work. I hope you got to use a cricket where it's wicked. If you're over in Asia, you say shaka da da vaya. If you're over in Europe, you say hashawan, hashawan. If you're over in Africa, you say <laughs> Don't laugh at me, Zendaya. Zendaya laughing. <laughs> Zendaya getting at the age where she know what's going on. All right. Watch Facebook Live. And watch the last broadcast I did on Periscope. Because it's hot. 